This is a tutorial created for the Tallahassee Apple Users Group. Have you ever received a document that you had to edit or review and you wanted to make comments while you're making changes to the document? Well, here's how, uh, one way to do it using Microsoft Word. I'm opening up a document that I've downloaded at random from the web, moved it into Microsoft Word, and we have something here that we want to comment on. Okay, here's a comment by this Apple CEO, Tim Cook. If I go over to review, find the comments section, click on new, and now a bubble appears that I can type in my comment. Did he really say that? And now when we send this document back to the person who asked us to review it, this bubble comment will appear attached to the section we wanted to change. We can make others. And for example, we'll move down here and comment about surprise $500 in purchases. Again, we go to review, comments, new, and we type in $500 is too much. And now we have two cop comments in bubbles with this document. If we want to change the format of the comments, we go to style, I think, up here where it says balloon text, and you see right now it is presently in Lucinda Grande font, nine point size. We can change that. by modifying it, balloon text, so forth, so forth, and now we can increase the font size to say 14, remain in, in the Lucinda Grande, click OK, apply it, and now you see the font size has changed. We also notice that I've made a mistake in my typing, so I can go back now and correct my typing. And when we save the document, we can, this will go with it. We can send it by email. We can send it by uh, posting it to a website. Um, and if we don't want to use this document or our comment, we click the little X or go up here to delete. And you've deleted it. If you have any questions about any of this, ask one of your friendly T-Apple members. They can help. Good day.